Here's a view of what we're tracking here in the Weather Center to kickstart your Tuesday morning. It's a clear and cold start, so make sure that you are bundled up. Before the day today, we're tracking the sunshine. We'll certainly notice more clouds tomorrow out ahead of our next system. That system will likely bring some wintry mix, especially for areas north and west of D.C. And they'll likely arrive late tomorrow night, continue through much of our Thursday. And that ice accumulation will be the main concern, leading to some slick travel at times. Could be tricky as well. Otherwise, we're going to be seeing a cold rain expected to see that change over from that wintry mix to that cold rain later on in the day as we look ahead towards Thursday. So, again, temperatures out there this morning, though, it's cold. Upper 20s off towards the north, low 30s closer towards the district, upper 20s off. Also for Waldorf, but we're into the mid 30s right now, or upper 30s, I should say, Fredericksburg as well as Lexington Park. That radar right now is all clear. It is quiet. It will certainly turn a bit more active, a bit more colorful as we look ahead towards late Wednesday and into our Thursday. We're watching this system back out towards the midsection of the United States. We're looking at snow showers well off towards the north, towards North Dakota as well as South Dakota. We do have that wintry mix for parts of uh, southern Minnesota as well as Iowa, and then we do see some severe weather down towards Dallas. Texas, where they do have a tornado watch there. Snow, uh, along with some blizzard warnings back over towards parts of Colorado. Back here locally, we do have a winter storm watch issued. That goes into effect 7 p.m. tomorrow evening, continues through 1 a.m. Friday. As for Western Maryland, parts of West Virginia as well as parts of Northwest Virginia. And that, again, goes until 1 a.m. Friday morning. This area, this is where we could see some of that ice accumulation. So that's why that winter storm watch has been issued. Today and tomorrow is relatively quiet. Today we'll see high temperatures, low. 40s, mainly sun filled. Now, overnight tonight, we see those temperatures dropping back upper 20s, starting about 30, but highs tomorrow, low 40s. We'll certainly notice more cloud cover by the afternoon and that chance for some of that wintry mix to move in late Wednesday night into Thursday. Thursday, we do have that DMV first warm day. We're looking at that wintry mix, especially along and north and west of I 95 uh, into Thursday morning. But then we should see that change over to mainly rain for DC area south and east, and even that rain snow line will likely continue to lift its way farther off towards. In north and west, as we do see a bit of a surge of a little bit of more of those warmer temperatures, or at least well above the freezing mark. So, again, towards later on on Thursday. Future cast showing us we'll see increasing cloud cover through our Wednesday. Now, looking at it towards Wednesday afternoon, this model still wants to show a chance for a shower or two. But I'm thinking that will hold off at least later on Wednesday night. Here's a view of that leading edge of some of those rain showers, some of that mixing in with a few uh, areas of pink. And then we're looking at widespread precipitation as we look ahead towards that Thursday morning commute. Now, those areas shaded in pink, this is mainly north and west of I 95. We can't with that chance for at, at some points in the morning that we could see some of that wintry mix right around the district before changing over to mainly. Rain and then eventually that rain snow line moves its way farther off towards the north and west. And then we should see some drier conditions trying to push in. So get towards later on Thursday night. And then those winds certainly pick up. So get towards later on on Thursday. And that still the wind will still stick around as we head towards Friday. Here's a view of the rest of that eight day outlook. So again, a DMV first warm day Thursday for that system that will move in, bringing some wintry mix to the region. And we're back into the upper 40s Friday, low 40s Saturday. Still cold wind will be with us through the weekend. Sunday, though, we're looking mainly sun-filled, but cold highs, upper 30s. Shanika's here with the On Point.